going on everybody? It is Isaac Rock here, back with another Animal Jam video, and today we are going to be doing a story time because I've never really done one of those. I want to sit down on Animal Jam and just talk about some Animal Jam experiences that happened now. I've been playing for years now, we have no idea, and there has been a lot of crazy things that happened to me. And I don't know why you guys think I clickbaited you guys because you guys should have seen the thumbnail. It says story time on the thumbnail, even though it didn't say it on the title. You guys should have paid attention, I'm sorry. Anyways, we're gonna be talking about this time I got hacked by my best friend. Yes, by my best friend. It's, it's gonna be crazy. Before we get into that video, I first want to get the Rare Item Monday because it is Rare Item Monday day, you guys already know. So we are going to the store and we are going to be getting the Rare Item Monday for today. So today's Rare Item Monday is the Rare Old Top Hat. So I really like it. It's an old top hat and it's blue and I really like it. So I'm going to try to make a look with it right there. There you go. It matches. It suits me a lot. I love it. Anyway, so let's just talk about this whole entire story time. Let's just get right into the video. Now, I remember this day like it was yesterday. It was April 15th, 2014. So that was about four years ago. I was a eighth grader, 14 year old, you know, just playing Animal Jam, chilling. Before I get into detail with this video, I want to clarify that I will not be mentioning specific jammers due to, you know, hate or anything like that. I'm not going to mention anyone specific. I would just name them by a different name. Uh, but yeah, because I am friends with some of these people that I'm going to kind of mention. So back in 2014, there was a trend called calling for items. Now, this is something that Animal Jam no longer does, but it was a trend that was in 2014, 2013, I believe. And many of you OG jammers might remember. Um, basically, you can ask Animal Jam HQ for any item back. A lot of people did take advantage of that opportunity and they decided to lie to Animal Jam HQ. Uh, pretend to be hacked or scammed and Animal Jam actually sent 20 items to each person that claimed they were hacked. I was one of the first- wait, what did I just accept? Oh no. Did I just accept- uh oh, that was a spike. I don't even know what I just accepted. Now I'm not gonna lie, I will admit I was one of those jammers who called for items and don't get mad at me guys, everyone did it. You can even ask your favorite Animal Jam idols, like literally more than half of them have did it at one point in their life. It's It was a trend, all right guys? And yes, looking back, I regret doing it. It's not funny, you know, you shouldn't lie about getting hacked or scammed. It's a big issue today that we are facing in Animal Jam and it's something that we need to help prevent. So you could call for items and what my friend and I did was we called Animal Animal Jam HQ for items, we called for spikes and gazelles and all this other cool stuff. You know, my friend and I wanted to split half of the items, we're like, you know what, you have half, I have half, and basically what happened was we did end up doing that. I got some gazelles and some pigtails, my friend got some spikes and some other gazelles. Now I'm just gonna name this person as Bob, okay? Now I was friends with this Bob person for a very long time and I'm not gonna lie, he was a huge hacker back in the day and I am no longer friends with him because you know what, hackers and scammers are not cool. Um, but he was a big hacker back in the day and you know, we were friends and it turns out him and his friend, uh, I don't know, we're just gonna call him Zach. You know, and I'm still friends with Zach to this day, which is again anonymous. I'm still friends with Zach to this day, but I'm not friends with Bob anymore. So they both hacked me, but they hacked me because my friend, I'm just going to name her, I don't even know, Flower. So when Flower and I called for items, we were happy, but apparently she went behind my back and wanted to get the rest of the items that we called for, even though she had half, I had half. So Flower decided to tell Bob and Zach to hack me, and it worked. Everything was gone, I was crying. I was 14 years old, okay? I'm gonna cry over animal jammers. I mean, everyone has cried in one point in their life when they got hacker scammed, but let's be real, and if you haven't, you're not normal. Or I don't know, you're not normal. I did cry, I'm not gonna lie, I was very upset. But then again, I was looking back and I'm like, you know what, I didn't even work for these items, we just called for them, so like, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. Since I got hacked, I did decide to call Animal Jam HQ for rares again. Um, luckily they were nice enough to give me rares and I did get my rares back and after that I never called for items or I never really associated myself with hackers or anything like that. I've been hacked about twice, I've been scammed a couple of times, um, but it happens to everyone eventually. It's part of the Animal Jam experience unfortunately. Just play safe and just don't get involved with hackers or scammers or anyone bad in the community because it's just trouble for you. And yeah, so that's what basically what happened. I ended up getting my items back and I wasn't friends with the other people that hacked me besides Zach. Well actually Zach and I weren't even friends anymore. But Zach and I recently reunited about two years ago so Zach and I have been friends ever since and he's no longer a hacker or scammer. He doesn't even play Animal Jam. I just know him outside of Animal Jam now. So that was the story of the time I got hacked. And I, there was another time I got hacked and that was by my sister, Ariana. 
Anna that I did make a video with her a couple of months ago. It was My Sister Plays Animal Jam for the first time. And how did she hack me, you ask? Well, it turns out my login was already logged into my computer. She decided to go on Animal Jam and I don't even know. She decided to go on my account and guess what? She logged in and deleted all of my items and replaced them with goggles and some Frankenstein wig. I don't even know what it was, but I was so sad. I cried too. That was like freshman year, I believe. <laughs> 2015. I was a freshman. Yes, I cried when I got hacked. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but I got over it. Another tip to prevent scamming and hacking. Do not, and I repeat, do not save your password on anyone's computer. Not your computer, not your mom's computer, no one's computer, because it is very easy to log into someone else's account if the password is already in. I'm not even kidding. Don't do it. I regret doing it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this story time. There are more things to go into detail about, but I decided to not really do it because, I mean, it's really hard to not mention these specific people, so that's one problem. And also, it was a long time ago. I just want to forget about the past and just keep moving forward and being positive and being happy because at the end of the day, guys, they're just rares. Yes, rares are cool. They're cool to collect, but just remember that if you do get scammed or hacked, it's not the end of the world. You will have friends who can donate. You can always trade back up. And of course, we have the amazing Animal Jam HQ team that will love to help you guys. Even though they get a lot of emails every day, they will get back to you. So if you guys ever have a problem with scamming or hacking, make sure to contact Animal Jam HQ, no one else. Animal Jam HQ, they're the only... Animal Jam HQ is the resolution to your problems when it comes to scamming and hacking. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on Instagram at TipGrockyAJ. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Goodbye. And also, let me know if you guys want more story times. Literally, I have so many crazy experiences when it comes to this game. You guys don't even know. Anyways, I'll see you guys later.